Prop 29 is all about new rules for kidney dialysis clinics. The measure would require these clinics to have at least one physician, nurse practitioner, or physician assistant with six months of relevant experience, be on site in person, or in some cases virtually during treatment. It would also require clinics to disclose all physicians that have clinic ownership interests of 5% or more to their patients, and also to report infection data to the state. And it prohibits clinics from refusing to treat patients based on the source of payment. This is the third election in a row that voters have been asked to decide on changing the requirements for kidney dialysis clinics. Measures in 2018 and 2020 did not pass. Supporters of Prop 29 say the measure will help give greater protections to dialysis patients by making sure the companies that run dialysis clinics allocate some of their billions of dollars in profits to making the clinics safer. They say it will also lead to less discrimination against patients. Opponents of the prop say that it would increase health care costs and cause clinics to cut back services or shut down altogether and that it would worsen the health care worker shortage. The California Democratic Party supports Prop 29 as does SEIU United Healthcare Workers West, the Republican Party of California, along with the American Nurses Association, are against it.